The Panther's engine and drivetrain evolved throughout production, facing performance and reliability challenges. Engine development. The first 250 Panther Ausführung D tanks were equipped with a V12 Maybach HL210P30, 650 horsepower. But by May 1943, it was replaced with the Maybach HL230P30, 690 horsepower. This increased speed, but also led to overheating issues, prompting the addition of a cast iron engine block instead of light alloy. Two multi-stage cyclone air filters. An engine governor, November 1943, to prevent excessive heat buildup. Despite improvements, fuel leakage and overheating led to engine fires, forcing better insulation and cooling systems. By war's end, reliability had improved significantly. Steering and drivetrain, the Zahnrad Fabrik Friedrichshafen, a K7 speed gearbox worked with a manned single radius steering system, allowing the driver to control turns using levers. However, the final drive units were weak, made from lower quality steel, and had an average lifespan of just 150 kilometers. A stronger gear housing helped, but a full redesign wasn't planned until the Panther II, which was later canceled. To reduce wear, Panthers were transported by rail close to deployment zones.